as me Four hour time. 
Father's Day is coming up. Father's Day is coming up. I haven't got my dad anything for Father's Day, but we do have plans to go up to see my parents uh, that weekend. And as a matter of fact, um, the 15th is the day that I turn in my keys to my old apartment. Thank God. I'm not going to miss that place whatsoever. I could care less about the... There's no sentimental value. I'm not sad. Um, I was a little bit of... I, I was... Actually, I was a good deal sad when I moved from my townhouse because I really liked that townhouse. And you guys remember, um, I wish... Part of me wishes that I had this camera set up in this this audio quality there. I, I wonder how well we could have done at that place. It wasn't it wasn't the quietest. It's definitely quieter here. But I sometimes just wonder how it would have played out had we had, you know, all of this equipment. Um, a lot of you guys have been asking for a setup tool. setup isn't quite finished yet. I still need to, um, I still need to, uh, figure out my desk situation. Um, I'm still using the same desk that I had before, and so this is, I know it's a temporary desk. So when I went through the setup of this desk and the setup
Dark Souls 2 or Dark Souls 3. I've never played Bloodborne. I've never played Sekiro. And so there's a lot of From Software games that I can go out and enjoy uh, after the Elden Ring DLC drops. Um, that might be uh, something that you guys can expect. Oh, I cannot believe I didn't mention this earlier. Um, I'm kind of back to creating content uh, on my gaming channel. So I want to give a quick plug to my gaming channel. Um, if you made it this far, 10 minutes in, I'll try and pop something up on the screen if I remember. But yeah, guys, I do have a gaming channel and I want to start exploring um, gaming content. Uh, you know, outside of ASMR. You guys know that this is something that I've done in the past. I actually went through and privated a lot of my content. Um, a lot of my old streams, a lot of my old Warzone content, anything that was not 2K based, I privated. And that's because, yes, I think I'm going to pursue a video um, two days ago and uh, I didn't share it on this channel because I wanted to see um, how much how much traction it would get by itself without the outside sharing of this channel but uh, obviously it, it didn't do as well as as I had hoped and it didn't do as well as um, my previous videos that I had it on that channel, but most of the time when I posted on that channel, I would share it on this channel so that it got the visibility, the same level of visibility that this channel gets. Um, so maybe, maybe I'll share it um, on like Sunday or something, but I want to start doing streams and I want to start doing at least one video a week, maybe two over there on the gaming channel. I posted my Luka Doncic build um, you know, with gameplay and everything, so uh, I like the idea of doing like full gameplay videos um, with just a little bit of editing, obviously, but I really like the idea of doing a no money spent series on 2K25 because 2K has become really, really, really money hungry. Um, I, I say it's become, it's always been money hungry. But especially recently, it's felt very, very, very money hungry. And so I want to um, maybe make a series. Uh, a lot of people have been uh, making content based off of no money spent because they're trying to show or prove to spent player in 2K. Um, it's probably very difficult, but it's possible. I hope that, um, you know, those of you that are fans of my 2K ASMR, I, I owe the initial blow up of this channel was 2K. Um, back in 2K17, uh, those, if you know, you know, kind of deal. Um, and a matter of fact, Specifically, Troy Dan ASMR is probably oh, Tro Troy Dan ASMR. Troy Dan is probably the more um, uh, more of a catalyst behind this channel's blowing up because he posted a 2K ASMR video um, way back in like 2K17 or something like that. And I want to say that my videos were probably recommended on that video. So. Shout out to Troy Dan. Uh, that was back in 2K17 when I had probably less than a thousand subscribers, and now we are approaching 100,000 subscribers. So I cannot, um, I can't, I can't not recognize that there's been a lot of, a lot of different like phases of this channel and uh, the ASMR 2K 
is what originally helped blow this channel up, so I, 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 there will always be a special place in my heart for 2K. Um, but I, I, I found, I find myself, I found myself this year. Span, whereas um, other games like Call of Duty, like MLB The Show, like um, basically any other yearly release, I would only play for like two months, one month, two months, three months. But I've been playing 2K for like literally, um, I would not go, I would say I haven't gone. Obviously, I go through phases of playing other things and doing other things and going out of town and getting busy doing other things, but um, I'd say I have not, I, I've, I've, I've got to level 40 every season except for one, and I want to say that, that maybe it was the season that something else happened. I think maybe I was playing Elden Ring over again or something like that. Something else consumed my life, but um, yeah, I've been playing a lot, a lot, a lot of 2K, and um, if I can um, have fun playing 2K, then that should translate over to content when it comes to uploading 2K. So I want to just say don't go and subscribe if you're not going to watch the content and I don't want that to come off as like uh, like uh, ungrateful or anything like that it's just I don't want to inflate the channel's numbers um, you know and it end up being um, counterproductive I only want people to go and watch the content if they truly like the truly want to uh, be a part of that community and help build that community. Um, uh, kind of a secondary community, and who knows, who knows what could happen, who knows what could happen, especially with vertical streaming on, on YouTube. Who knows what could happen. I could, you know, start to see the same level of growth on that channel that I've seen on this channel, and, um, you know, the sky's the limit there, but what else, 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 um, I can't really think of anything at the moment, Fortnite, um, I'm working on getting a I should say AGN is working on getting a team together to uh, do some Fortnite squads, and I should probably play before we do that, because I have not played Fortnite in weeks, uh, probably well over a month now, maybe even two months now, so maybe I should uh, dust off the old Fortnite and get back in the swing of things, but I know this season's been
was in a sushi mood, so I got a lot of sushi. And I gotta say, I was thoroughly impressed. It was the first time I had been there, and it was pretty delicious. It was really fresh. Um, they kind of make it, they don't make it in front of you. It's not like one of those places, but it's, uh, you know, they have like a sushi bar. So you can see them while you're, you know, they're not doing it in front of you, but you can like see them working and making the, the sushi rolls. So that's, uh, that was nice. Um, it was a nice little date night. It's been a while, so it was kind of our first uh, quote-unquote date since moving to the house. And uh, it was refreshing, you know. It was refreshing. My belly's starting to rumble because I haven't eaten lunch yet, and it's 12.30 in the afternoon. So I may just leave you guys with this. This may be the job.